Today was a day different from any other day. Everything was normal till I picked up the daily newspaper on my driveway, as I do every day. But when I picked up the paper, I noticed in big headlines, a song is over, and I saw a picture of the Beatles in the background. At first glimpse, I thought another Beatle artist had died, and I was quickly attracted to the article. But little did I know that I was about to read. <laughs> this article was not about the death of a Beatles artist, but about the death of a fellow Chino Hills resident. I was amazed in a horrifying way. I continued to read the article and began to slow down, trying to comprehend what was written in bold black ink. I still couldn't believe my eyes. I still remember reading over and over the same line, stunned. The way the article was written, I was so moved. I later found out that this kid named Jason was only 20 years old. Later, after reading the article, I went upstairs and looked him up on the internet. I found a website dedicated to him. The website described that he was diagnosed with a mental disorder called schizophrenia. I researched it and it gave me all these different types of mental disorders that are commonly found in young adults. I still remember the paragraph about what happened that night. As I and about 85% of Chino Hills was asleep in their beds, Jason Tenney's something that would change not only his life, but the lives of many others. He walked out of his house and walked for some time. No one quite knows where he went that night, but I believe he went somewhere to find peace, tranquility, and possibly a way out from his confusion. Later that night, at about 3.30 a.m., he stepped out onto the black asphalt and encountered the bright lights of the oncoming vehicle which ended his life. This 
is not what I do It's the wrong kind of place to be cheating on you It's the wrong time She's pulling me through It's a small crime And I got no excuse And is that all right, Jay? With my gun